What's up guys? In this video, I'm going to tell you four simple ways to help you build your credit. For more videos like this one, hit that subscribe button. But for now, let's go ahead and get into the video. Boom. <laughs> What's up guys, it's Jay and welcome to Flashpoint. We're all about credit, credit cards, and other finance tips. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Also, be sure to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. It will really help me out a lot. I really appreciate it. And comment down below with your thoughts on this video. And also guys, do not forget about my $100 American Airlines gift card giveaway for once I hit 1,000 subscribers. So if you're new to the channel, subscribe, like the videos, and comment on the videos. I appreciate it. That will enter you into the giveaway. Now, wow, you're saying, okay, well, what are these four easy ways to, to build my credit or to even honestly to honestly recoup your credit honestly you could probably use all four of these options and i think they're going to be very helpful so for one the obvious first choice is going to be to get yourself added as an authorized user to a person who has been very responsible with their lines of credit okay now this is also referred to as piggybacking now what this does is this is going to allow the main account holders positive credit history from that specific account to reflect onto your credit report and basically what this is going to do is in as little as 30 days you will see your credit score boost right and this is basically just because new a new line of credit has been added to your account and you have now gained new positive payment history added to your credit report so that is an that is one great way to help build your credit or boost it up okay if you need to number two is going to be Experian boost and I have a video on Experian boost I will leave it up in the cards right here so you can check that out so you can get a little bit more details on what Experian boost is but basically it is a free service that you can sign up with and what it does is it adds new trade lines to your credit report okay so what will happen is uh, if you pay your gas, electric, phone bill, uh, any of your utilities, it allows you to add your utility bills to your credit report and they any positive payments that have been paid will help boost your Experian score only. So this is for Experian only, okay? Now again, I urge you guys to check that video out that I left in the, in the cards um, if you would like more details on what Experian Boost is, okay? Now, the third option is you can always go to self lender, right? This is a service that allows you to open up a credit builder account and it's also going to allow you to save at the same time. So what they do is they open a credit builder account in your name without taking a hard inquiry to your to your credit report. And uh, what's going to happen is you set the loan term, you set the dollar amount that you wish to give on a monthly basis, whatever fits your budget. And they put all those terms and they put that loan in the form of a certificate of deposit. And now it is an FDIC insured CD in which you are making payments to. But the great thing about this is that your payments are being reported as on time payments to a secured loan okay but what you need to know is that your payments are going towards that CD and once you finish making those payments towards that loan term then that unlocks the CD and allows you to get your money back right so I think that is a great uh, way to build your credit and you know I mean it, it's a great way to build credit and save money at the same time I mean who would not take that option and the fourth option would be to go and apply for a secured credit card. Most times with a secured credit card, you do have to put an upfront deposit and basically whatever amount that you place in the form of a deposit will be considered the line of credit that that specific card issuer will give you. So let's say for instance, you put down 
$200 as a deposit, then your line of credit that gets reported to the credit bureaus will be $200, okay? Now, the more you show that you're making the on-time payments and everything like that, then they may upgrade you from a secured card to a regular non-secured card that gives you no rewards. One great secured card that I think would be a, a pretty good option would be the Discover it secured because I believe it, it offers rewards. It still re offers cash back rewards, which is a great thing. So consider applying for the Discover It secured card because you will get rewards. And obviously you're going to be building your credit at the same time that, um, you're getting cash back rewards. So who that, you know, that's a win-win. I know it's tough to build your credit or to even have to try to recover your credit, but I think these four options are great options. If you're someone who maybe had bad history with, with credit and also needs to, you know, find a way to build it back up because uh, what can happen is with bad credit, you're going to get some of the worst loan terms if you need to get a loan uh you're just going to get high interest rates you're going to end up spending more than what you should just because you've had some bad luck or you've been a little irresponsible when you were a little younger i know that's happened to me a couple of times but um and then i also had my identity stolen so you know there was a need for uh building my credit back up but uh, I think these are great options. So consider these options, guys, and I feel like uh, this will put you in the right direction. I also have videos for the top three choices. So if you would like, I will go ahead and leave them in the cards. So just all you have to do is click that icon and it will show those videos. Okay. And that'll conclude today's video, guys. For more video updates, hit that subscribe button. If you found this information to be helpful, give the video a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Share it with your friends. Drop a comment down below if you've used any of these options or if you plan to. If, if you think that they're good options, let me know. Uh, yeah, don't forget to hit the bell notification down the bottom left corner so that way you guys can stay up to date for whenever I drop my next video. Be a good person, be safe, be smart, and remember, credit is your life. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace!